for illegals to get jobs Americans should be getting. Yeah. Once again, this year in the state legislature, there was a, a bill put forth by a good friend of mine, Sandy Adams. And she and I worked very hard last year, over the last two years, to try and pass several pieces of legislation that dealt with making sure State contractors use E-Verify. It is the one tool that is out there that we can, at the state level, make sure that at least people getting state dollars use E-Verify. And once again, it did not pass. We are two weeks away from the end of session. The bill was heard in one committee. At least this year, it got a hearing. It got one it was then, it was then re-referred to four more committees. Derek Gerbeck and, and I were up in Marco Rubio's office and 
Uh, I talked to his chief of staff, George Lovec. I guess Marco was too busy about the, you know, this problem to meet with us. So we talked to his chief of staff. They promised us they wouldn't impede these bills. And then when I got out on the uh, floor, the Democrats and the Republicans, you know, we were getting a lot of support from both sides of the House. Democrats and Republicans saying that they supported this measure that we need to put Americans back to work. And Marco Rubio blocked all those bills. He doesn't even have the guts now to uh, admit that he was the one that was behind us. You know, he's not a stand- Any elected official, and I don't care whether it's this city hall over here, it's a county commission where you live, or it's a state legislator, and they tell you that they're against you verify, they need to be fired.